Take not a step further, child, for you are unprepared. You, at last. I wondered when you would show your face again. Step away. We have nothing to discuss. Desist, child. You cannot confront the monstrosity unleashed upon this land without due preparation. I shall not allow it. All right. But no more riddles. Enough of the obscure songs and prophecies. I ask questions, and you answer them. My words have been as clear as crystal lakes, my child. You seem unwilling to drink, to listen, to learn. What is your true appearance? I do not understand. This is who I am. Blood? You are made of blood? Surely you are joking. Why would I? And no, I'm not made of blood. I am blood. Blood is what I am since my birth and for eternity. But who are you really? Tell me your name. I am your maker. I am the servant of the Red Goddess and protector of this land. I have many names. Just give me one, then. There are those who call me Murdin Wild, the Wild Horned Man. But I never was a man. I was born out of blood. Why did you choose me? Only you could provide a modern, scientific answer to this ancient, mystical threat. Speak to me of this ancient threat. The blood of hate. Vessel of the wrath of the goddess. When she awakens, a disaster will be born into this world, for she is hunger and anger. What kind of modern answer? Disease, contagion, and contamination. How they course through veins is your dominion, my child. Your choices have made you. Only you can save this land. I'm here to stop Harriet Jones. She is the original carrier. The well from which this corruption flows. I have heard you, but be wary. Harriet Jones's mind is no more. She has metamorphosed into an apocalypse. Born from, drenched in, and driven by the blood of hate. Tell me about this disaster, creature. I know London fell victim to such a thing in 1666. A disaster is pure anger born through blood. Its name means bad star, for they only appear when our queen unleashes her unquenchable wrath upon the world. And who is this queen? She is the Red Goddess, the Queen of Blood. In my youth, a hundred lifetimes ago, she was worshipped as the Morrigan. She is my mother. She is yours, too. The Morrigan? The Celtic goddess of war? Is this a ruse of some kind? She has been worshipped in many forms throughout the ages. The true nature of the Red Queen is beyond your comprehension, eluding even mine. But know this, she is a vengeful mother. So the... That's your modern answer. But a disaster... Tell me what it is, then. A disaster is the pure will of our queen. Whenever she dreams... What is the blood of hate? It is the curse of the goddess. It is the hunger in you. The need for blood. 
The will to strike and to punish. To spit in the eye of God. I only wish to know how to put an end. To perform an act so noble, you must protect yourself from it. I know. McCullum used such a serum when trying to kill me. However, I have produced a more efficacious version of the antidote. Your final task awaits you at the end of these tunnels. I've known for ages. What will happen thereafter? What future awaits me beyond these dark tunnels? Your fate, my child, and the fate... Will it be over then? Once I... Yes. The threat will dissipate like so much smoke. And then what? How would I know? Will... Yeah. And then what? How would I know? I am no god. <laughs> you tricked me. My sister... Very soon you'll come to know that sacrifice is sometimes... Be brave, my... I'll be glad to be of assistance. Ah, oh, like your help, Doris! Liars! All of you! <coughs> My poor baby. I've been such a bad mother. But the Queen herself forgave me. Gave me another chance. Harriet. You must stop all of this. I can't let you infect anyone else. How dare you interfere with the Red Queen's plans, Doctor? How can you stop the course of nature? I was a...
It's locked, all right. Dr. Reed, do you need my... See you later. Have you... The sad saint will always be a target for vampires. Have you... Of course. They're dedic... Are you... It seems the guard of... Really? The guard can be reckless. Goodbye. Good evening. Rest the sh <laughs> None taken, sir. Show me what... There's no... Why not? There's always the night asylum. There is no shame in asking for help, my boy. I don't feel okay with that. Have you... It keeps him... What can you tell me about the... Not really. Miss Gillingham smiles and says kind words. Tell me about this crazy woman. <laughs> the poor woman's... What can you... Not... Goodbye. Step away, stupid beast! Stop the fire! Good evening. There's no need to...
Goody. No. That's quite Sir? Do you need me? I'm at. Alright. Just. He provided a roof for me and. Why is that? He's a voice. Tell you. You don't know me, Miss Paxton, and yet you see me as. Oh, your manners, your clothes. Oh, no. Alright. Okay. If you have something to say, say it. Oh. You want information? It's... I'm killing myself scraping for a living. And you? Have you ever... As a... Oh, a doctor. Hmm. What? Cold... Well, I... Uh... You again. Are you still feeding on corpses? No. It's almost as though the blood you forced me to drink has provided me eternal satisfaction. Have you seen Harriet Jones? No. She is with the sewer scales now. But what? I just lost her for a minute that night. What, what happened? That we ran here through narrow streets and backyards. She kept saying that someone was talking to her. What happened? I guess we recognized each other. As scals, I mean. How when younger, I used to patrol the street. You really are? Oh, no, sir, I'm not. Had you already visited their hideout in the city? Just once, and... Would you... No, Dr. Reed. You already forced me to drink your blood, and I thank you for that, for I feel better now. But it was quite an unpleasant experience. It would help me greatly if you would allow me to give you a physical examination. I said no. I'm no subject of medical exam-
How is there's a lot of sadness and pain in my flock? I how are even if we're all children of God, I've always maintained. What do you f a few years ago? A sc what if food became scarce? The skulls can feed on the dead, Doctor, and until Judgment Day, mortals will continue dying. Farewell, Sean. It's locked, all right. This must be a picture of the bomb explosion Dyson Delaney spoke of. Glad. What? Giselle. Perhaps. Perhaps you're right. But I'm tired of. Don't you think she wants to get better? I believe she knows her alcohol. And you? On the contrary. What do you? I don't believe. Giselle, that's cool. mother. Giselle. Sometimes words are harder to forgive than acts, Doctor Reed. Perhaps you'll see. I know that, and I don't blame her. It... Goodbye, Miss. It's locked.